People are not paying their parking tickets in Durham, and it's costing the city a lot of money. City leaders are trying to figure out what to do about the issue, as they're owed nearly $700,000 for unpaid citations. WRL's Durham reporter Sarah Kruger shares what staff is proposing to do about it. Parking on the street in downtown Durham will cost you $2.50 an hour. If you don't pay here, you could get one of these, which will run you $30. Thing is, thousands of people are getting these and just not paying them. The sinking feeling of coming back to your car and finding the green paper on your windshield. The parking enforcement workers are always busy in downtown Durham. Have you ever gotten a parking ticket in Durham? No, I haven't. I, I pay for my parking. What can I say? A lot of people don't, though, and then they don't pay for the citations either. A new report City Council will receive this week shows more than a third of the parking tickets issued in the city since 2020 have not been paid. That's roughly 50,000 tickets. Nearly all of them are at least three months old. In total, that means the city is owed roughly $683,000. That's a lot of money and people should pay their tickets, but there are also situations where people just can't pay. Um, so I think increasing you know, transportation and allowing people to have those methods that they don't have to pay for parking. I definitely thought there was um, some type of system in place that, you know, held people accountable for paying for their parking. According to the report, city staff thinks it can improve in that area too, acknowledging a robust collections process does not exist for collections of outstanding balances. It's looking into how to hold people accountable. Some hope ethics alone can motivate them to change their ways. And if you pay for parking, you should, if the parking is paid, you should pay it. You know, it's the right thing to do. One recommendation that came out of the report is the possibility of using a collection agency to get people to pay up. Sarah Kruger, WRAL News, Durham.